Good evening, I'm Eden Shackle. And I'm Calvin Hughes, and here's a look at the stories making headlines on this Thursday night. A home connected to rapper Sean Kingston raided in Southwest Ranches today. The singer's mother, Janice Turner, was arrested on fraud and theft charges. A civil complaint from Verver Entertainment alleges Kingston partially paid for a 232-inch television and entertainment system, but failed to pay after the system was installed. The complaint also says the artist used his fame to scam people out of products and services by never paying for them. It's unclear if Kingston will be taken into custody. A 21-year-old woman is in critical condition after two cars crashed into a church in West Little River. The vehicle slammed into the new Solid Rock Baptist Church on Northwest 91st Street and 22nd Avenue. A light gray car also hit the church. The video shows witnesses rushing to help four crash victims. They were taken to Jackson Memorial Hospital's Ryder Trauma Center. Three of them are now in stable condition. The Miami Beach Police Department is gearing up as Memorial Day weekend approaches. Officers say they will be getting additional help from state troopers to scan the license plates of cars crossing the, Macar the MacArthur and Julia Tuttle causeways into the city. They also say unlike spring break, there will be no DUI checkpoints and certain residential zones will be blocked off to visitors. Visitors can also take part in the, in the Hyundai Air and Sea Show. And surveillance video capturing a fatal crash in Lauder Hill, a driver attempting to turn onto Northwest 14th Street and 31st Avenue early this morning when another car slammed into them, sending both cars flying. Police say 50-year-old Daryl Walker died from his injuries. Two other people are now recovering in the hospital. And remember, as breaking news happens, we have you covered on air and online. You can always go to our website for more information, local10.com. Be safe out there. See you back tomorrow.